Now, I'm getting just as tired of talking about this Conor Ben situation as you guys are hearing about it. Although, to be fair, my Conor Ben videos are still doing good numbers. So clearly there's a certain amount of interest even now. Eddie Hearn and Gareth A. Davis, by the way, before I talk about Eddie Hearn, has only just cottoned on to this. And I'm not dissing Gareth Davis, but I seem to be the only one, the only one I'm aware of, who's been talking about the fact that Hearn and Conor Ben want us to focus on the WBC's investigation. When what we really should be focusing on, what we really care about or should care about, is the UCAD investigation. Not the WBC. That's neither here nor there. A WBC ban doesn't really mean anything. It just means that you can't compete in WBC sanctioned bouts. Well, there's three other major sanctioning bodies out there. It's no big deal if you get a ban off the WBC. They can't stop you boxing in any country. Whereas with UCAD and the British Boxing Board of Control, they can stop you boxing in your home country. You see? So that's what people should be focusing on. The fact that Conor Ben gave up his British Boxing Board of Control license rather than subject himself to the uh, penalties of the British Boxing Board of Control. You see, now, there was some casual who turned up in the comment section of one of my recent videos about Conor Ben, who said, oh, what are you smoking? Ben doesn't even have a British license, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, he doesn't have a British license because he gave it up. And he said, oh, it was, the WBC and VADA are the ones that found the substance in Conor Ben's system. You kind of got nothing to do with it. <laughs> You're a fool. It's in many articles, including Sky, many other uh, online websites, <laughs> big major websites, all report, uh, Gareth A. Davis himself, all reported the fact that UCAD opened an investigation into Conor Ben and they were liaising. They were getting information apparently off VADA. VADA don't investigate. You see, this is how ignorant this person showed themselves to be. VADA do not investigate anything. All VADA do is test. They don't do investigations. <laughs> okay, you can do investigations. The British Boxing Board of Control do investigations. Yeah? So that is what we should be focusing on. If we're talking about Conor Ben clearing his name, well, we want to hear what UCAD and the British Board have got to say with the evidence that they got off VADA. Yeah, with the things that they looked into. That's what we want to hear. That's going to be a ruling, a judgment that actually means something. Now, did Conor Ben giving up his license stop that investigation from proceeding? You know, UCAD's investigation. Did it stop it from proceeding? I don't know. I haven't heard anything about the investigation since. Um, I think maybe one or two journalists have made some illusion that it's still going on behind the scenes, this UCAD investigation. But perhaps it's limited in terms of what it can do with a guy who's not licensed currently. So again, Eddie Hearn and Conor Ben want everybody to focus on the WBC and ignore the fact that we want, what, what people should be focusing on is UCAD and the British board. <laughs> that investigation is going to be far more thorough, I have to imagine than what the WB, and not only more thorough, but more significant. What can the WBC do to Conor Ben? If they exonerate him, for whatever reason, that's not the same as the British board exonerating him. That's not the same as UCAD exonerating him. But this is what Eddie Hearn and Conor Ben don't want you to focus on. <laughs> that's why they don't even talk about UCAD anymore. Have you noticed that? Eddie Hearn and Conor Ben don't talk about UCAD at all, or the British board. So, so the you know, Conor Ben fanboys out there, please educate yourself before you leave a comment. A UCAD investigation was opened. UCAD liaising with VADA to get all of the information off them, the test results and so on. And the British board involved in the investigation is what, that's what was going on. But Conor Ben wants to pretend that that didn't happen. Eddie Hearn wants to distract people away from it. No. Let's not allow them to do it. The only, the only justice or uh, how can I even describe it? <laughs> Exoneration or condemnation 
that is going to mean anything is with UCAD and the British board. Forget about the WBC. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below.